This video is transformative in nature. Any gameplay and commentary displayed in this video should be considered covered under fair use law. This game is rated M for mature. Viewer discretion is advised. Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Persona 5. In the last episode, well, we entered Headpat City. And the god, that was actually amazing. I actually quite loved that moment. It was, it was too cute for words and I loved it. Anyway, in this episode, we're probably going to be doing a lot more social link crap. And then maybe we'll finally actually enter Sei Nijima's heart. I don't really know. Maybe we will. Probably not in this episode. Maybe the next one. Let's see. Who do we want to hang with today? Haru is available. And Shinya. Uh, I think we can actually finish up Shinya in like two... Rounds, if I'm not mistaken. Mm, thinking about it. All right, let's look at the confidant list. Oops. Before we actually put ourselves into that position, which I was getting close. Weapons dealer. Yeah, we need two more. So if he's gonna rank up at this point, we should probably just finish it up. All right, sounds good. I wonder if Shinya is going to discover that we are a phantom thief. Hey. They sure did. Ooh, hamburgers were kind of great. God, I could, I'm like, it's weird. I, I get so much hungrier at night and now I'm like really craving a good hamburger. <laughs> Wow, that's actually kind of awesome. Um, overall, I'm like really happy for him. Let's see, I want I just want to say I'm glad to hear that, but at the same time, I also think that thank the Phantom Thieves might be a good option. <sighs> like, here's the thing about all these social link choices. I feel like if I don't choose the right one on eight, I w I'm sorry, uh, on nine, then I won't get ten. It's it's just a weird feeling, but. Hmm. You know, let's just stick with the standard response. I'll say I'm glad to hear that. Nice. Actually. Huh. I guess that's true. I think there's always something good to having a competitive spirit, but at the same time, I don't think that anybody should be consumed by it, if that makes sense. It's like, it's fun to compete and all, and I mean, always striving, there's nothing wrong with always striving to be the best at something. But I think when to throw everything else away just to always win, that's when you've kind of gone too far. I know, it's a little bit of a weird abstract thing I'm thinking of, but I don't know. I feel like I unintentionally give life advice like every episode, and I'm mostly like, kind of more stream stream of consciousness at night which is usually when i record these though to be fair i am recording this way later than i usually do so if i'm overly talkative or not talkative at all i'm really sorry i mean i guess that is a good way of putting it a loss oftentimes hmm, oftentimes a loss is a a situation where you can grow and become better, I think. Well, don't always be happy to lose. I guess it just means that you've matured, really. Look at that. Somebody finally matured. Nice. Level 9. 
just what I was hoping for. I want to max out tower before we go into Say's dungeon, specifically. Oh yeah, I remember that guy. It was a while ago though. I guess he just wants to win at all costs. Seems like he's totally gonna figure out that we are the Phantom Thieves. All right. <laughs> it's kind of obvious. It, it after a couple of the the other non-party member social links, it kind of became obvious that they're gonna figure out like that we're a Phantom Thief. But that's fine. They still haven't caught the culprit. What are the police doing? Do your jobs. You're nothing but tax thieves. How long are you gonna let the Phantom Thieves run loose? This country's done for. Someone better take responsibility. I should start doing funny voices for those. I feel like I, I it's a missed opportunity. <laughs> Though to be fair, I don't often have a chance to do voices in these long form RPGs. I think you might be reaching a little bit. Ugh, I don't know. I don't think that there's any way that anybody else in our school could possibly be. That's a good point. Hmm. That's a good question. If he's just a hitman, that would be really weird. Hmm. It would be kind of interesting if it were just like a random hitman is the is the guy and like I don't know. I don't know what the what the possibilities are. Honestly, I feel like they haven't really shown us enough. If it were like one of one of your social links, like any of the social links that you come across have the potential to be the culprit that would be interesting but that's unfortunate <laughs> well i'm looking forward to that hmm Well, this is getting interesting. All right, we already maxed out. I keep doing that. Maybe I should be focusing a little bit more on Haru. She is the lowest one so far. I don't know, I guess my brain is just telling me max out the ones you've got before you actually go into the next ones. Yuki Mishima. Mishima might be an interesting one. If I can hang with him today. Nope. Hifumi is available, and Mishima is available. I think I'd rather finish up Mishima first. Turning down the walls. I love this game. Hmm. 
the night theme is just like it's it is so perfect. Hey there, Mishima. Alright, sounds good to me. Alright, let's hang out with Mishima for now. Are you gonna cheap out of another free meal? Oh, jeez, Mishima. Extortion? Eh, well, I feel like extortion is probably one of the pettier crimes in... ...in general, I guess. Well... Either way, I think you showed some real courage, my dude. Ah, hmm? <laughs> uh, well, don't tell the ladies that. Oh, these two punks again. It's just Ooh, come on, dude. Hey, you guys mind just fucking leaving <laughs> leaving this guy alone? Oh, Mishima. Look at that, Mishima doing the cool thing. Hmm? Yeah, I do think Mishima's changed a little bit. He's definitely gotten a lot more confident. And overall, I think he's become a better person. Eh, something like that. Yeah, I agree. He seems like a pretty alright dude. You know... I guess your perception of people changes. <laughs> your perception of people change as you get to know them. All right. Hmm, well, do your best, man. We got anything for rank 9 or we wait until 10? Looks like we're waiting until 10. All right. Ooh, interesting. Whatever you do, just don't use our real names. Actually, we could probably tell you our code names. That would work better. You know, I'm actually kind of feeling a steak. Ah, uh, all right. I imagine the way he said that was... Woo! Like unenthusiastic fake woo. I don't know why. <laughs> it's just what I thought of in my head. I know it was real dumb, but hey, who cares? Jeez, our popularity could not drop lower, could it? I say as it drops a little bit lower every day. Hello. Hey there, Yusuke. Yes. Ah, uh, not yet. I want to do a couple things before we actually go. I see.
You got it, don't worry. We've got plenty of time. And I also don't want to rush into this dungeon willy-nilly. If this is really the last one until we get caught... Grab your notes. I'm still expecting it. I'm, like, I'm expecting two more dungeons past this one. Like, one or two more, at least. Like, I feel like there's gonna be, like, one... For, uh, uh, just like in four, I'm expecting there to be, like, some big uh, god boss sort of deal. Uh, and I'm expecting, like... Uh, one for another portraited character that's been in the game the entire time. We have to go into that guy. Uh, and maybe something with the with the true culprit, maybe? So I was thinking three, but well, I guess we'll see. Last time we were talking about how court trials work. Today we'll be learning about... I mean, yeah, of course I'd get a trial. Uh, zero. I actually do know this one, and I'm acting so confident I won't even look at the network. Exactly. Well, unless it's juvenile court, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, if it's a juvenile, you're not allowed because they're they're still protected for, under privacy laws. But for any adult trial, any any um, person above the age of 18, I believe you can actually sit on, on any trial. Haha, <laughs> yeah! I was totally right. Juvenile crimes. Well, unless they were juveniles. It's that impressive. All right. Though I don't exactly remember where I learned that from. Yeah, the biggest problem they would have is proving our method, right? I mean, as long as our method makes no sense to the public jury, I don't think anybody else would care. Huh. I wonder why Morgana was so quiet on that one. We have plenty of time. Har is available. And it seems like that's my only option, actually. Yeah. Wait, what? Futaba? I'll decide later. Yeah, let's go right away for Haru. I should have what I need for her, uh, for her link, so it should be relatively easy. Why? Actually, I was hoping that we could hang out. Actually, wait, wait. Let's say I'm here for the vegetables first. I really hope this doesn't make, uh, just doesn't pass time. Moonlight carrots, huh? I'll give a look at those later. Fully restores SP to one ally, fully restores 100 SP to all allies. Let's get some sun tomatoes. Let's see how many we can actually make. A full heal works a lot better, actually. Wow, six days for this, jeez. It's gonna take a while. Alright, then let's hang out. Well, that's secret. Hmm. 
I, oh my god, I just realized that Haru is a new social link, so her dialogue is actually new too. So I should probably get used to see- uh, I'm so used to seeing everybody else's dialogue like a thousand times that I, I'm just used to skipping through. Alright, let's hang out with her. I mean, what do we have to lose, right? Yeah, I, I dabble in a little bit of infiltration tool making. Well, I mean, any supplies are really good in the metaverse, aren't they? That's an interesting one. You don't strike me as the coffee drinker. Yeah, I figured you were more of a tea person. Yeah, it's weird. I also like... it's. Uh, I enjoy coffee and tea a lot, but I prefer tea like when I'm trying to relax overall. But I like... I like coffee like in the morning if I need to wake up. It, it feel it does kick me into high gear in the morning. I don't know. Eh, to each their own, but I am definitely more of a tea person. I think. Huh? Yeah, sure. I don't mind. Um. Ingriate? Ingratiate. Oh my god, my brain was like, how do I- how do you even pronounce that? Ingratiate themselves to me. Huh. Well, I feel like people, your father left a lot, like a huge power vacuum in your own company. And no offense to you at all, I think you're a very competent young lady, but I also think that you're very young and inexperienced. And having you be the head of the, of the company is making you a target for a lot of the people under you. Yeah, I figured. They're basically just using the situation, being as ruthless as possible. Hmm. Honestly, he just sounds suspicious to me. Hmm. Definitely sounds like he's trying to manipulate you at the very least. Honestly, this sounds like a complex issue. Sometimes you just need somebody to listen. I can understand that. If you ever need anything, let me know, Haru. All right. And we finally got Baton Pass. That's nice. Which means now that we have Baton Pass, she's, I don't know, infinitesimally more useful in battle. So I guess her practical skill is going to be the next thing that upgrades. 
and then we'll get another battle skill. It's weird that we had to wait this long for it, though. Hmm. Who's available besides him, anyway? The Y is nice and all, but I'm curious to see what else we can do. Oh, man, I really want to... I want to finish up Ifumi as soon as possible. Also, I think we should probably update our gear. I'm not sure if I did that before I took my long break. Actually, I just want to shop if you don't mind. Let's see. Okay. Sounds good. Anything new? There's definitely some new stuff. Mm, that one. <laughs> Break it, okay. You know, I might just cut this out. Or I'll do it later. Uh, don't sell the dirk. You can come in handy later. Alright, I'll do this off screen. Uh, come again. <laughs> Let's see. Anyway, what were, what were you saying? You said something crazy happened? Yeah, sure. Let's hang with Iwai. Good. I actually really like Iwai. Like, everything about him is cool. Actually. I love his character design. I love, like, he looks like a, like a kind of cooler Junpei with a little bit of, um... Uh, I want to say a little bit of edge. And it's, it's actually really, really cool. I kind of want to do that with my sideburns, the... Like, combine into the chin sort of deal, but I can never pull it off. I know, no, I, I know myself way too much, too, way too well. Oh, really? That's interesting. Wow, interesting. You know what? I'm gonna be honest. I don't want. I don't want to say it's impossible. I mean, overall, I don't know. It feels like that's the answer that I would honestly give. Ugh. Hmm. Yeah, I'll just go with I don't know. Sorry, I had to take a, a quick swig. What do you mean something suspicious? Is there somebody else you have to deal with as well? As long as you pay me well, you got it. <laughs> when have you not seen me courageous? <sighs> hey, first time you use my name. Interesting. Thanks, old man. Though I guess I do usually call so drew old man, so I don't really know what to call a Y. All right. Good. <laughs> All right, sounds good. Look at that sweet proficiency bonus. Really? I didn't get anything for rank 8? Uh, I don't know what I was expecting. I guess we have to max out before we get anywhere. Wait, was that 8 or 9? No, that was 8. I, st I didn't see. I was looking at the number. The lower house disbanded. It was an intern- It was an internet uh, internal split. Jesus. As Masayoshi Shido. He's the only one. He's the only one that can stand up for what's right. The only one who will make good on his word. That's the kind of person we need leading this nation. Especially in times like these. Shido leaves the United Future Movement, right? He was right. If we'd taken the Phantom Thief seriously from the start, they'd be, they'd be behind bars by now. 
Which will come first, do you think? Regime change or the apprehension of the Phantom Thieves? Considering we've seen the future, I think it's fairly evident which one's gonna be. Oh wow, that's true. <laughs> we won't fail. Thanks, Futaba. <laughs> it's pretty outrageous, yeah. Wait, what? <laughs> well, f actually, I think that's pretty much... Are they just gonna keep adding to this board? I don't- I'm not sure if I made a comment on this last time, but I totally noticed that there was another drawing there. At first, it was just the, the Phantom Thief hat, then they crossed it out, then they added a little poop. I wish I could read the, the Japanese here. I should totally get my friend to help me translate this. Anyway, I guess that should be it for now. So I will see you guys in the next one. So, see you later, everybody.